Guys, um, this is kind of late. Um, I was gonna make this haul video once I got back from my trip, but meh, stuff happens. So I am just gonna show you everything I bought. I have some note cards down here to show me that I wrote down all the prices and stuff on. So keep, I'm sorry for me constantly looking down. Um, I'm kind of gross today. If my hair looks kind of gross, it is. Um, I'm letting it have like a repair day. I do that every so often just to make sure it's doing good. But to start off with, from Amazon, I bought a navy floral case and it was $10 and it's on my phone right now. I'll put a picture in. Um, my phone tripod was $15 and that was with shipping. And from AliExpress, I got this Nicolas Cage shirt for $12, but it's normally $13. And it's just Nicolas Cage all around. <laughs> um, it's pretty good quality so far. It's a really nice fabric. I love it. Um, I, I like memes, to be honest. And then I bought from Forever 21 these sunglasses. They were $5.90. They're just black kind of circle lenses. I liked how they looked and they're gonna go well with the project that I have in store for them. So hopefully I'll do that soon and I will be recording that. Next I have from Hot Topic, I have this matte lip cream in Deepest Berry. It was $4 and it's just a matte lip cream. I mean, it's not the best because it's from Hot Topic, but it looks a lot better when I put it on my lips and the color payoff is better and stuff, but I like it for like dramatic kind of stuff, so I take pictures with it. Don't wear it, but yeah. And then from Hot Topic as well, I have this Bill Nye pen and Shrek pen, and they were $2, two, two pins for $3, which is a deal Hot Topic pretty much always has. And they're normally $2 a pin. And then I also bought my friend a Gerard Way pin and a Bob's Burgers Louise pin, because that's what he wanted. And then from Rainbow, I bought this white hoodie, and it was $6. Just a very crop top kind of thing, hoodie, short sleeves. I like it a lot and I'm going to use it for an upcoming project and I'll be recording that as well. And I also bought fake eyelashes for $3. They are Profusion Day and Night. They're not that great of quality. I mean, I didn't expect it. They're just for a project though. And they come with an adhesive. I don't know if it's that great. I don't really do fake eyelashes ever. I might experiment, but who knows? And then I, and those were three dollars. I think I mentioned that. And then I got these light wash high waisted shorts, and these were twenty dollars. And they are just stretchy, acid wash looking things. They have three buttons. Whoops. And they have pockets, which is nice. Kind of shocking, right? Then from a thrift store that we went to, I got three books. The Emperor, Emperor Swords Pentacles by Phyllis G-O-T-L-I-E-B. And I need to read these all soon. Then I got Matched because I've been wanting to read it. And The Garden of Vegan. And it's normally $18 and I got all these books for a dollar or 50 cents, which is really cool. And then, also from that thrift store, I got this shirt. It's like a holographic kind of thing. I don't know, it's glittery and weird, and I don't exactly know why I bought it, but I'm glad I did because I've got fashion sense, definitely. But it's just kind of like a holographic kind of thing. I don't know, I thought it was cool. And it was only $2, so it's okay. Then, this purse is also from that thrift store. It's just a strap. It can be worn like this or like this. So that's nice. 
and it has one, two, three, four, five, and then a pocket inside of here, so six pockets. It's just nice, I like it. Um, and it was $3. I might acid wash it, kind of. Bleach it, I mean. And then I got shoes for $2. They're kind of like men's work shoes. I don't know why I didn't bring them. But they're nice and they were $2 as well, so whatever, right? Then lastly, from the drugstore up there, I got two things from Copa Naturals. I got this lip butter in the flavor root beer. Eh, probably won't focus because it's just a phone camera. But it smells exactly like root beer. Like, it kind of smells like, what's that thing called? They sell it in Colorado, that's, um, Dr. Hansen's natural or something. It smells just like that and it is great. And I love smelling it because I don't get that very often. And then I got this bath bomb. I'll link it in the description. I forgot what it's called because I didn't even write it down because it's not listed on it. But it's just this little light bath bomb. Oh, hi, Lucy. Um, it smells very clean and refreshing. Hi, hello, baby. This is my dog. She's a love. Um, so that's about all I got. I'll record the second part. It's just going to be really short tomorrow. And so yeah, see you then.